In this video, we'll talk about AR error 120092 in the reconciliation. Error message for this error code is the dataset ID and reconciliation identity combination is not unique. You'll see this error when reconciliation tries to assign the recon ID to unidentified CI, which is already given to another CI in the same dataset. Purpose of this error is to expose data duplication. If you are seeing this error in reconciliation logs means you have duplicate CS in source data set according to identification rules. Let me explain this with the example. So here we have two data sets. One is BMC Editium, which is source data set and the other one is BMC asset which is target. CI1 is already identified and merged into BMC asset according to token ID in the identification rule. Now CI2 comes into the picture as it has recon ID as zero. It goes through identification activity of reconciliation. Reconciliation starts searching for token ID equal to ABC in BMC asset data set, which is our identification rule. So it finds one record in asset, which is uh, CI1. So it tries to give recon ID associated with CI1 to CI2. Then reconciliation finds that one record is already there in BMC ADDM data set with the same recon ID. And then it throws AR error 120092. That is data set ID and recon ID combination is not unique. So you can't have same recon ID for two CIs in same data set. This is as designed to avoid duplicates in source data set. Let me show you how you can debug the data from the logs. Open the reconciliation job log and search with 120092. You'll find the error message. And just about to that line, you will find the reconciliation ID and instance ID along with the class name. So here is the reconciliation ID. It is trying to associate that ID to this instance ID and for computer system class. So what we'll do, we'll copy the recon ID. We can go to the BMC core computer system form and just search with that recon ID you'll get two CIs, then to another search with instance ID. So I'm just copying instance ID from the log and doing search in another tab. Okay, so we got the data. So what reconciliation engine was doing, it was trying to copy this recon ID to this new instance ID and then it failed with 120092 error message. So let's check the identification rule which it was using. So as I was using standard recon job, I can just go to the standard rules editor. From reconciliation console. Go to standard rules editor and in identification rules we can check for a computer system what all rules it was using so first priority rule is token id second priority and you can check all the other priority rules as well so let me check with the uh, token id first so for this new ci token id is abc let me check the existing one so for CI, which is in asset, also has the same uh, token ID. So on the basis of token ID, it is considering this new CI as the duplicate one. So to resolve this issue, you'll need to change the attribute in the identification rules, which uniquely identifies the CI. If it's really duplicate CI, then you will need to delete the duplicate one from source data set. You might see uh, one special case where the CI which is in source data set which is already identified may be marked as deleted set to true. 
in that case uh, you'll need to uh, run the purge activity to hard delete the soft deleted CIs after they have merged to the target data set thank you for watching this video